Hi, it's Pinkpoint. In this video, we will talk about and how to convert an octal number into a binary number. Let's say we have 67 octal. How we are going to convert this into a binary number? First, rewrite this number with enough space in between. So this is 6 and this is 7. Then we are going to convert each digit towards its binary equivalent. The octal value is represented by three binary digits. So raise to 0 or 1. So raise to 1 or 2. And 2 raise to 2 or 4. Then convert 7 into a binary number. We need to consider that 7 is a sum of 4, 2, and 1. Since 7 is a sum of 4, 2, and 1, then these numbers are both 1. So this is 1, 1, and 1. Then same process for the next number, number 6. So this is 1 or 2 raised to 0. This is 2 or 2 raised to 1. And this is 4 or 2 raised to 2. Since 6 is the sum of 4 and 2, we put 1 below 4 and 1 below 2. And we put 0 below 1 since we don't use 1. Now the binary equivalent of 67 octal is 110. 1, 1, 1. And for our second example, let's say we have 5, 3, 6 octal. And we are going to convert that into a binary. Next is to write the numbers with enough space in between. So this is 5, this is 3, and this is 6. Then convert each digit towards its binary equivalent. Since octal is represented by three binary digits, so this is 1 or 2 raised to 0, 2, 4, 2 raised to 1, and 4, 4, 2 raised to 2. We need to consider that 6 is a sum of 4 and 2. So since we use 4, this is 1. We use 2, this is 1, and we don't use 1, so this is 0. Okay, move to the next number. This is 1, 2, and 4. Then 3 is the sum of 2 and 1. We don't use 4, so this is 0. We use 2, so this is 1. And we also use 1, so this is 1. And for the next number, we have 1, 2, and and 4. Since 5 is the sum of 4 and 1, so 4 is equivalent to 1. We don't use 2, so this is 0. And we do use 1, so this is 1. So the binary equivalent of 536 octal is 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. And for our third example, we are going to convert 4 to 1 octal into a binary. So again, we write the number with enough space in between. So 4, 2, and 1. So this is 1, 2, and 4. 1, 2, and 4 and 1, 2, and 4. For 1, 1 is the sum of 1 and 0, so we have 1. 2 is the sum of 2 and 0, so this is 2. And 4 is the sum of 4 and 0, so this is 4. We use 4, so this is 1. We don't use 2 and 1, so these are 0. We don't use 4, so this is 0. We use 2, so this is 1. We don't use 1, so this is 0. 
we don't use 4 and 2, so these are zeros. And we do use 1, so this is 1. So the binary equivalent of 4 to 1 octal is 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, and 0, 0, 1. If you want to check your answer, you can convert 4 to 1 octal into decimal. So 4 to 1 octal into decimal. To do that, you can multiply 4, 2, and 1 by increasing power of 8. So this is 8 raised to 0, 8 raised to 1, and 8 raised to 2. So 4 times 8 raised to 2 plus 2 multiplied by 8 raised to 1. Plus 1 multiplied by 8 raised to 0. So this is 4 times 8 raised to 2 or 8 times 8 is equal to 64. Plus 2 times 8 raised to 1 or 8 times 1 is equal to 8. Plus 1 times 8 raised to 0 is equal to 1. So 4 times 64 is equal to 2. 5, 6, plus 2 times 8 is equal to 16, plus 1 times 1 is equal to 1. So, 2, 5, 6, plus 16 is equal to 272, plus 1 is equal to 273 decimal. The next is to convert the binary equivalent into decimal. So, we have 1, 0, 0. 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Then we are going to multiply this one by increasing power of 2. So this is 2 raised to 0, 2 raised to 1, 2 raised to 2, 2 raised to 3, 2 raised to 4, 2 raised to 5, 2 raised to 6, 2 raised to 7, and 2 raised to 8. So, 1 multiplied by 2 raised to 8 is equal to 2 raised to 8 plus 0 multiplied by 2 raised to 7. Since this is 0, we can cancel this one because any number multiplied by 0 is equal to 0. So, we can cancel all the zeros. Then proceed to 1 multiplied by 2 raised to 4 is equal to 2 raised to 4 plus 1 multiplied by 2 raised to 0 is equal to 2 raised to 0. Then 2 raised to 8 is equal to 256 plus 2 raised to 4 is equal to 16 and 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1. So 256 plus 16 is equal to 272. Plus 1 is equal to 273 decimal. Then we get the same answer, 273 and 273. With that, we are certain that 4 to 1 octal is equivalent to 100, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1 binary. And that's how you can convert octal numbers into binary and check your work thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet and tap the notification bell to be notified every time i upload a new video